Hi, Rosie. How you doing? I'm sorry that I'm streaming so late. Uh... Let's just say this is partly the reason why I'm uh, planning to move next year. No one's fault, it's just, uh... More story elements. I'm half tempted not to even stream tomorrow and just, or stream, but stream this game. Don't stand up too fast. I think I might do that anyway. Like I think I might just make an appearance, uh, probably sometime this week, and just let my guild know that my uh. We'll talk later. Just let my guild know that my sh uh, subscription to WoW is ending on the 26th, and I'm done raiding. Like, I don't even want to touch that game anymore. I'm kind of busy here. We don't have time for chit-chat. I guess it's just emails, then. Hey, CC. Uh, I don't exactly know yet. Uh, I'm either going to move in with my sister and brother-in-law. Or uh, I'm going to get my own place. It depends on a few things. It depends on if uh, I get a new job. If I'm still at this current one by the time I decide to move, uh, then I'll move in with them. Uh, if I find a new job, uh, then I would probably get an apartment somewhere. If I find a new job that pays more, I mean. Team suffer. Desmond is doing this one. Suffer. I said. I think I said suffer. My bad. She changed her password. They all changed their password. Ready when you are. She could just skip this. Go right back into the game, but... Oh well. Okay, so what was I planning on doing next? Oh yeah. Romulus Slayer. Uh, how much money do I have, though? Oh, yeah. I'll revitalize these two areas. This I think I already did. Yeah, I fixed this aqueduct already. Make this, this faction building. I'll make this one a thief building. Smith Place is north, I believe. Oh. And the Doctor Place. I'm gonna do that one, too. Oop. 
There we go. Yeah, so... I am so glad that I got to stream this tonight. I was a little worried that things... That I wouldn't be able to stream until much later, and in which case I would have just cancelled it. I wanted it at least two... I always want at least two hours. So I'll be ending this at 10, too, which is later than I usually do, but hey, Vlad. You know, I might just end at 10 from now on, it, as opposed to 9.30. It depends on what I need to do, still need to do before work. Oh, yeah. I stock out. But I didn't think you had them on. Go away. Three AM? Was it three AM for you? Oh, it's like uh it's eight PM right now for me. Well, it's almost eight fifteen. I can also lance boil pastures. Whoa, what the hell is happening to the camera? There is no well, there is, but I didn't... Well, there's a bank there. I wonder if I have enough to renovate that. No, I don't. I know I don't. Oh, well, we'll just keep that marked so I can get there. Oh, yeah, 10 p.m. when... yeah. So I only have like maybe a couple hours. Oops. I don't know if this is the last one. It could be. The Borgia's days are numbered. He will kill them all, though it may take a little while. We must awaken the people, stoke their anger, and focus their frustration. We must start a new fire in their bed. <coughs> Pope's oh, old, uh, this is the Pope's old residence.
You're gonna lose more than a block of health. I have a feeling that I'm not uh, going to be doing any fighting in this one. It seems like this is gonna be all platforming, if that's the case. Usually, if I have to fight anyone and I get a uh, and I get a bonus objective like that, typically means that I'm gonna be fighting someone. And it usually, it's usually four blocks or more, not one. Where exactly do I go? <laughs> yeah, I know, it's a really cool animation. Also means they're probably going to give me every opportunity to fall. So I have to be very careful. interesting that it's actually a little bit difficult to find where I'm supposed to start. Oh, there we go. He jumped to that? No, he won't. Oh, I know what to do. Okay, I have to... Uh <clears throat> I have to do that. <laughs> Better to do than try to explain it and not get my words out. Uh, no, there's nothing that I can get in here. Damn. It seemed like they were setting me up for that. This music gets so strange sometimes. Oh. Something shiny in there. No, I can't get that if I wanted to. Not in that area. Or not, not with those doors, it's locked off. Wait, I think I can do it over here. Oh, it's just a flag. I, I thought it was a chest. health. How many climb up that? I can't climb back up there. Oh, there we go. I can, it's just a little odd. was a uh, was kind of a sudden you know what I mean I can't get my words out today <laughs> I hate it when I have these days they seem to be more and more frequent I know what I'm going to say but I can't put it very eloquently Ugh. 
That was just for curiosity's sake. <clears throat> you know what's funny too? The more that I uh, stream like this, the less that that seems to occur. At least in my experience. It's probably because I don't talk very much outside of this. I heard something shiny up there, too, but I can't get it here. Holy hell, I hate it when it does that. It's so loud. I can get back up here. Oh yeah, I can. I should be able to. Hmm. He getting tongue-tied, CC. That's what, uh... is seeming to occur less lately. It still occurs, just less often than I it used to. The ability to make good words good, and sentences good. Oh, Jesus! I was walking on thin air for a split second there. I went backwards. I have to go this way. Oh, fuck. Wait. Yeah, I did go backwards. How am I supposed to go from here? Oh, up there. Okay. I can't walk. run up the... is actually a little difficult to figure out. Usually platforming is pretty straightforward. But in this case, it isn't. Interesting. Thank god I'm not timed on... Well, not that it matters much. Like I said, I'm not going to kill myself over uh, doing the full sinks, but... Oh. Can I climb up here? Yeah, I can. Okay, I really don't like that they gave me that tool tip right when I was doing that. Press B to drop, hold B while falling to catch back. I did it right before, but I think I'm supposed to, uh, I hope this is the case. Yes, that was the case.
Find a way into the Basilica. Now, I'm not getting all the flags. I'm not even going to bother with that. <laughs> with wheat in their mouths? What is that supposed to... I never heard that phrase before. I heard the phrase... I heard the phrase, uh... Sounds like you have marbles in your mouth. Not wheat, though. This is a little, uh... <laughs> like, I know it's mostly automatic, but that's still a little intense to look at. Inca, it's telling me I need to... Is there a chest? Oh! Okay. Have a pipe in your mouth. Okay, that makes sense. You're talking about a pipe that you smoke from. If I fall, I don't really have to say that every time, Ezio. I think that's kind of understood. At this point, anyway. More money. Please don't stutter like that game. You all, you probably don't see the stuttering that occurs every so I think it's my computer. It's not hot. Because it's been stuttering like that in every game I've been playing lately. You know what? Uh, I should have... I know what it is. I haven't dusted out my computer in a while. My computer's not getting hot, but I think it's that's what's causing the stuttering. You won't see it on your end because uh, my game is like at a smooth, like a nice smooth 60 frames per second. But the uh, stream itself, is, I'm only having I have capped at 30. So you might not see the stuttering on your end, but I it's and it's not it's not that. Major, but it's noticeable. And I think it's just because I haven't cleaned out my computer in a while. I should have done it this week, and I just got really lazy. CC, you're younger than I am. And not only that, 
Are mullets even popularized in the UK? I don't. I didn't even think they would be a thing for them. That was just something stupid. Uh. And Americans did at that time. By the way, Peter Dinklage looks pretty cool with a uh, mullet. He is one of the few people that can actually pull that off. I saw the preview for that video game movie. Pixels, I think it's called. That movie's going to be... It's... Looks like... It looked like it could be good if Adam Sandler wasn't in it. And it's not because Adam Sandler is a bad actor, it's because every movie he has been in, in like the past five or six years, practically every movie that he's been in has been awful. It's been like one, uh, one disaster after another for him for a long time. Your dad looks like Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler is not a bad guy, don't get me wrong. He made some really great movies in like the 90s and early 2000s. He has not been good since. He has been in nothing but down and th the thing is he gets he gets paid a shit ton of money to do those movies because and those movies make a lot but only in their first week and then they like plummet. So every movie he's in is a success because it makes his money back. It doesn't matter whether or not it's terrible. Especially because most of the movies that he's in don't cost that much to make. And in all honesty, I don't blame him. Uh, he's made so much money over the years, he can retire on it. At this point, he's just, uh, he's just doing movies to, I guess, to make sure that his kids are financially secure. Because he certainly doesn't need a retirement fund. I think he's got that covered by now. Didn't even pay attention to that. I don't even know what happened. That movie does look like it's going to be awful, though. <laughs> The funny thing is, too, two of those actors did voices in video games. Peter Dinklage did the ghost in Destiny. Well, he also voiced his uh, character from Game of Thrones in the Telltale Games uh, Game of Thrones. And I believe the guy with the glasses that I saw in the preview is actually the voice actor and the actor who played Michael Sun in Grand Theft Auto V. So they got two guys who have experience with voicing characters in video games. Everyone else I'm not so sure. I don't even think Adam Sandler's done any voices for video games. I think he might be a gamer, but I'm not sure. Right now I'm running around like a uh, chicken with its head cut off. Supposed to get up there somehow. <laughs> Jesus, that sounds like a nightmare. Honestly, I have no idea what I'm doing right now, because I completely missed that cutscene. Maybe... Somewhere around this way? Oh, wait. Okay, I'm supposed to go up there.
know why I de equipped my weapon. That's the third one. <laughs> I'll take your word for it, man. Wait. It's the second time I did that. Why do I keep going backwards and not realizing it? I see where you get it from. <laughs> where you get it from. Then. Oh, I just fucked it up. This one's actually... This one's actually difficult. Like, even, uh, even when they got a little more complicated in, like, the second game with the Assassin's Tombs, they were never like this. Grab onto this. Nope. And I lost. And I just failed. Sink. But again, that doesn't really matter. I would root. I don't even think you get more like money from it. Not that it even matters. But I really think, at least in this game, the only reason why you would want to get the full sync is if you were trying to want to... That's what I was missing. Is if you were trying to get a... If you were trying to 100% the game, that's it. If you're a completionist, that's all you would really go for. It doesn't seem like you get anything else from it. I could be wrong, though, but I never saw myself get, like, more money or anything from it. All bragging rights. Yeah, exactly. They have them in the other games. I don't remember if you do get anything extra for it in Assassin's Creed 4. Perfect. Route up if I fall. No shit, Sherlock. Oh wait, what am I doing? Was I supposed to do that? Oh yeah, I have to jump this way, okay.
I'm just looking around, making sure I don't miss anything. Especially if it's loot. Or money. I really should stop saying loot. I don't know why it keep, keeps de-equipping my weapon. There we go, that's the end. Amen. Even though I fucked up the full sink. That was still really cool. I, I like that I couldn't figure it out right away. That I had to like stop. I had to like stop, look around, and see where I had to go next. I actually. I don't remember it being that. Uh, like it was always very obvious in the second game. So whoever designs, designed them in this game did a pretty good job. Plus, I really, really like when there's good platforming like that. Yeah, good point. In the Assassin's Creed games, you'd be right, Vlad, or at least in my experience so far. There have been some games like, uh... And then I can really recall off the top of my head, but I swear there's been some games where... No, you know what? Um, Grand Theft Auto V. Uh, nothing main, main story related, but you do get something extra if you 100% that. Ah, this is where the rest of the chests are. This isn't the last one? I actually thought it was. Or did it pop up and say, like, so-and-so? Because, again, I must have missed it. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, I haven't dusted out my computer in a while. <laughs> in a little while. I've been really lazy with it. Like, it's fine. Like, it's not overheating or anything like that. But I noticed that it's stuttering. Which is not an issue for me right now. It's just a little... You can't see it on your end because uh, the frame rate's locked at 30. But on my end, it's 60 FPS, and uh, I can notice when it's happening. Oh, that brought me back into... I hate it when it does that. Brought me back into town. Can I get the next one? Uh the... Uh... The last one's not available just yet. Excuse me. It'll probably be available soon, though. It's probably down here somewhere. Oh, no, wait. I'm not that... Uh, I was only a little bit farther... ...up. Uh, renovate the bank here. I'm gonna do that first because I want to withdraw the money just in case 
Anything else runs me dry. Hey, Coco. <clears throat> I'm doing good. I hope you are too. Why does the camera wake out like that sometimes? These are cheap. Really? Young man with an apple is worth more than a Madonna painting. I know it's a game, but that just does not seem right. Worth more than Saint, a St. Saint George painting. You would think that the... Uh, the religious paintings would be would always be more expensive than these secular ones. Maybe that's just me. Oh. Oh, I can buy the rest of the feather locations. I have like five left to get. And the rest of the flags. I think this is a sign that I'm getting close to the end. The fact that I can buy where the locations of the feathers and the flags are. Well, thank you. Do come again. Your stepsister ate your chicken nuggets. <laughs> she didn't ask, she just took. I def, I def, I'm definitely gonna, when I wake up tomorrow, I'm gonna dust out my computer. Poor thing, I, I, I'm just, like, really not on the ball with, uh, doing that. I mean, um, with this computer, be, I'm glad that it tells me when it, It tells me just not in a conventional way that it needs to be dusted. It gets very noticeable when uh when it's getting too dusty. Hey, there's some people that are bottomless pits when they're kids. 
I had a cousin that was like that. He would eat, uh... Hold on. I can get this guy. I have a cousin who... I don't know if he still is. But he has an extraordinarily high metabolism. So he can eat everything and anything he sees. And he will not gain any weight. If I could email you some chicken nuggets, I would, Coco. <laughs> yeah, the, uh... I wish I was like that. I don't eat very often. Or, not that. I eat, I don't like to eat, I also have a low metabolism, so if I eat too much, I gain weight. And too much is, like, too little for some people. Too much for me is, like, too little for some people. Most of the time, I only eat two meals in a day, and I'll have, maybe have, like, something small every so often. There's very little food that I actually enjoy eating. Any other time, I just kind of eat and say, okay, I'm fine. For the next few hours. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know they were going to be there. A nice bit of work. <laughs> Coco, you know how that sounds, right? I wanted those nuggets in my face. <laughs> Insightful words. Words to live by. Yet Brother Ristoro spits at them. Now, were these men killed? They questioned Brother Ristoro. I think hands. you do. And now here they are, poisoned. You question him as well. Why don't you fear his wrath? A man with nothing fears nothing. I have remained true to my vows. I put my fate in the hands of the divine. Deus Ascutat. Your vows keep you from acting, so you seek another to do what you will not. Please, understand. I cannot kill. But I can. Where is Ristoro? He will be at the church, but guards always accompany him. 
<laughs> that Borgia cannot protect him from me. Sure, Coco, sure. Not like that. Give! And it shall be given to you. <laughs> For whatever measure you deal out to others, it will be dealt to you in return. These are insightful words. Words to live by. Yet robbery sorrow. See if I can take out this next guy. Well, sometimes they don't have the, uh... Sometimes they don't have- you're not in a restricted area when you do missions like these. Hopefully he doesn't see me. The last guy didn't when I did this. Hmm. Where is this guy? I did take him out by air assassination, so I would assume he'd be somewhere around here. Maybe he's inside, like underground somewhere. Because it seems like that's where he's leading me. <laughs> yeah, I could see that. And maybe it was just an oversight. Now that's a, uh... There's nowhere I can go down there. So it's not there. That wasn't him, was it? It is! You're gonna die. And I got the full sync on that one. You've gotta go now. Uh, see you later, CC. Thanks for coming. As always, I appreciate it. Can I not get out of here? I'm 
I'm not involved! Spare me! Oh yeah! Wanna do Leonardo's machines? I think I can buy. I think there's one last thing I can buy from him. But I I did all the war machine ones, or at least is the ones that they gave me so far. I don't know if I'll have any more. I don't think I will. Ah, there's no. This is the closest one there. That one's kind of close, so... I'll go to this one. There's one... Yeah, there's one that's just south of me. It's down here now. Hold on. What if I go down there? Will it reappear? Should probably see how my assassin buddies are doing. There, water's all gone. That's several. <laughs> nah, not this late at night. Well, I gotta go to work soon, so... Forty, sixty, eighty, a hundred.
I'll put her on it, and I'll give the other two guys a rest. Yeah, it might make this a little bit better if I had my horse. He forgetting I can call him. He is too good. Play when I get there, the bench will return. I don't know why it switched like that. Wrong way, wrong way. <laughs> I got back into the city. Ah, his, uh, his bench is gone. I swear I was, like, right around here. For some reason, he just decided he wanted to go down there. I just gotta make sure. I just gotta text. I just gotta make sure it's not important. Nope, it's not. Okay, well, I'm not going to... I'm not going on some wild goose chase, so... I'm gonna do this mission next. So, I'm gonna go to the tunnel entrance and go down there. Hello, Assassin's Creed Master. How you doing today? Wait, isn't this a bench? Now they won't let me sit on it. Nice, you got the Assassin's Creed 3. Just beat Brotherhood for the second time four days ago. Three days ago I beat Assassin's Creed 2 for the third time. Yeah, I'm assuming you played these all before because technically... Because 2 comes before this one. Why are they running from me? I'll be doing, uh, well, I've told you this before, but this is a reminder. I'll be doing Revelations after I'm done Sonic Adventure.
Eve's guild. <sighs> yeah, I figured that. <laughs> Oh! I didn't, uh, revitalize that art merchant yet. Oh. Oh. I'm guessing they're saving that last uh, Lair of Romulus mission for last. Because, unlike... In the second game, you could actually get the... You could do all the Assassin 2 missions pretty early and get uh, Altair's armor. Really early on, and it kind of makes getting the uh, the rest of the armor in the game very moot. You want it? I have it. The latest. Rogue's really market. short. It's probably a good idea that I wait for it to go on sale then. I heard that Rogue was. Don't tell. I haven't played Rogue yet, so don't tell me anything about that, please. But uh. I have not uh. I've heard good things about Rogue. I've never heard anyone say that it's really short, though. I think you kind of have to, because you go through that, uh... You go through the area behind it at one point. I know you have to get all of the, uh... What was it? There's, like, something that I didn't think you had to get. But in order to progress the story, you have to. Oh yeah, all the codex pages, you have to get all of those to finish the game. I didn't know that, so I was only collecting them as I was seeing them. I wasn't going out of my way for them. So, um... Yeah, I, uh, I think I only had like about 12 more of them to get, so it didn't take very long. And there's like 30 of them. All right, it's definitely underground. Yeah, it's down here. You almost fell up the steps. I'm curious to know how you how that's possible to <laughs> go go. Well, yeah, I know, but, um, the game didn't really, uh, like, I did all the Assassin's 2 missions right away, so, um, they said the same thing about the Codex pages, too. I needed full sync in order to actually progress the story any further. So, since I wasn't collecting those, they told me I had to get them first in order to actually beat the game. I'm guessing that's all, and it seems like from what you said, that's also true for Altair's armor. You have to get it in order to actually truly beat the game. But you can get Altair's armor very early on, and that's what I that's what I ended up doing. It seems like with this armor that you can get from the uh, Romulus treasure, it seems like they spaced it out more so they don't make any of the, uh, the armor that you get later. It seems like they did that so that it doesn't make the armor that you get like later on that you can buy useless. Because I still have one more layer of Romulus to get, and I know it rewards you armor. Well, I know you're fine, Coco, because you're talking to me right now. Buongiorno, Ezio. It is time to pay a visit to Lucrezia's lover, Pietro. I've sent my men out to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may... What is it? Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the castello. 
Machiavelli. Do you have proof? No. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The board yes, I hope you didn't hurt, hurt yourself too you much, Coco. Okay. Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? Oh, I'll, I would probably get Altair's armor early every time, because I like those Assassin's 2 missions. I like, uh, even though the platforming can get kind of wonky in Assassin's Creed 2, uh, they were still a lot of fun to do for the most part. The Lairs of Romulus are pretty much the same thing, but I actually like these a little bit better, because especially that last one, <clears throat> they didn't make the platforming as obvious. Or at least in that last one, anyway. Okay, uh... You know what? I really gotta go to the bathroom. Uh, I'm just gonna, like... I'll be right back. I shouldn't be more than a minute. Sorry about that. <laughs> Water shoots right through me. I was on a mission. Oh, okay. Oh my god. <laughs> he just pushes them down. <laughs> 